Wait, you can play volleyball in the strongest battlegrounds? Hey! Ah! Yes, sir! That's out, that's out, that's out. <laughs> Oh my Clearly. god! Nah, no more than this Mr. Nice Guy. Bam! Bam! Ah. Damn, it's too hard! Yes, sir! In this video, I test 100 experiments in the strongest battlegrounds. Like how you can play blade ball in private servers. Oh, 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 Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> Does Metal Bat Tornado affect Death Counter? Boom. Give Awakening. Now, I've got the Savage Tornado ready. Let's hit him with the Death Counter. Let's see if it actually works. And Savage Tornado. Oh, there we go. Yeah. There's only a few moves that can really be a Death Counter. And this is not one of them. Can a wall block reversal red? Spawn a brick wall. Boom. And then I'm gonna switch to Gojo on this account. Perfect. Behind the wall. I'm gonna go on the other side. And let's see if it actually kills. Wow! <laughs> it just went straight through the wall. I didn't even see where he was and it killed him. Can a wall block you from a trash can? I'm gonna go ahead and pick up a trash can. And obviously it should bounce off, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go really close to the wall, to the back of the wall, and see if it still has a hitbox on the other side. So he's right here. Throw the trash can and see if he gets hit. And no nope. wall can indeed block you from a trash can. Does Praise Peril work in the air? Okay, so because they added zero gravity now, you can actually try out moves while flying. So let's see if it works out. Right, and then we're gonna both jump at the same time, and then when we're up in the sky, I'm gonna use Praise Peril, and we're gonna see if it actually still works. So, boom. Oh, okay, we're finally in line, perfect. Okay, so we're close enough, we're in the air, we've hit the ceiling, so now I use Praise Peril and hit. You can actually counter him in the air. <laughs> it actually worked. Wait, but it's sending him up higher. Did we just break the ceiling? Yup. Miog, where are you going? <laughs> How far does Hollow Purple actually go? My alt is all the way on that side. Okay, boom. Okay. Let's see it starting. Here it comes! Wait. Did it kill me? Can't move. Oh, it actually killed me. Damn. Okay, so Hollow Purple actually goes that far. Does it actually have like infinite range? Can a wall of trash can stop reversal red? Let's see. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna spawn as much trash cans as possible. It did not work for the wall, but hopefully it'll work like this. It's like popcorn. Now I'm hungry. What do I say? And we're spawning these trash cans. Okay, so this looks pretty thick enough. We just get some more over here. Okay, boom. Now we have a bunch of trash cans, a trash can wall, if you will. We're gonna put my alt right here, and we're gonna see if Reversal Red will just go through it. I kinda see him, kinda don't see him, but let's see. <laughs> it just went straight through the trash cans. Yo, it actually built like a tunnel. <laughs> Can a wall of dummies stop hollow purple? Okay. Well, this server is about to get hectic. Hold on. Oh, you know what? We're going to make it better. We're going to spawn blocking dummies. We're gonna spawn as much dummies as we can. We're going to make an army of dummies. Okay, and boom. So here we have created our wall of dummies. Let's see if the hollow purple will defeat all of the tubbies. Oh, here it is. Hollow purple. Yo, it's slowly making it through. Yo, why was it so tiny? Did they change it? Oh my god. Yo, look at all this destruction. Bro, it destroyed the server. But the Goku survived, kinda. Will a dummy die from fall damage if you spot it while flying? Okay, okay. I'm pretty sure this one just isn't gonna happen, but you know what, let's just test it. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna change it to zero gravity, right? And then when we spot it, Wait, if we spawn the dummy with zero gravity, will it just fall or will it float? I guess we're gonna find out. So let's hit the ceiling. Let's get to the ceiling first. OK, 
Okay, boom. So I think we've made it to the ceiling now. So let's spawn this dump. Oh, that boy is falling. Oh, that boy is falling. Hold on. Let me fall too. Ah. Oh, where is he at? What the heck? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's coming down. <laughs> Bro. He did not <laughs> He didn't die, but he bounced. <laughs> Oh, right. Yep, but still in perfect health. 100%. So what is the strongest move of the game? Now, I don't know why I wrote this down because we know it's all Gojo's, but I'm pretty sure it's either between normal punch or maybe a foul ball. Let's see. Okay, so he's at 100%. Beat down. So beat down put him at 83%. Okay, okay. okay. Well, let's try foul ball now. Okay, that left the W at 90%. Okay. Okay, so let's try home run. 85%. Okay, home run strong. Okay, nice. Grand slam. Okay, 83%. Wow. So grand slam is just as strong as beatdown. So that's the strongest move for Metal Bat. So, 100%. Damn! Okay, so one normal punch. Damn, with fall damage too, it put it at 70%. So guys, a normal punch is the strongest attack we've had. Can a wall block flame wave cannon? Okay, so now that we have everything lined up, let's see if the flame wave cannon will go through the wall. Yo, what? It actually stopped it! There's no way! So the walls actually can stop Genesis Blast. That's crazy. Can a wall of trash cans block Flame Wave Cannon? Let me go spawn on these trash cans. Oh no! No! I'm stuck! Help! Help! Okay, there we go. Alright, we've made ourselves a little nice wall of trash cans. So let's see if it'll actually block the flame wave cannon. Okay, so now here we are. Will the flame wave cannon stop all of the trash cans? So we got a nice view here and let's go. Oh! It did not stop nothing. And it just missed my dummy by an inch. <laughs> okay, on to the next one. Can you death counter praise peril? Awaken. Right. I'm gonna death counter. I'm gonna go up with praise peril. And there it is. <laughs> yeah, it is completely true. You can death counter praise peril. Can you death counter death counter? Let's both pop our Ooh, I don't know why that's so epic. Okay, so now count, you're gonna go first, death counter. Okay, nice. Now I'm gonna pop my death counter and let's see. Hit me! Hit me before it runs out! Oh, it definitely did not work. Okay, can you bounce a trash can off a wall and hit something? So let's see. This is this is gonna be pretty hilarious. And I'm gonna throw the trash can, bounce it off the wall, and hit my man's in the face. Hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna ricochet it. I didn't get my aim on point. <laughs> yes, indeed. You can bounce a trash can off a wall and hit someone. Oh, this one's going to be fun. Okay, so can a bunch of walls block incinerate? Okay, perfect. I can fly now. And in this game, so if you guys didn't know, the wall will place wherever you are in front of you, even if you're looking down or straight upwards. So you can actually build some cool stuff, as you'll see later in this video. Okay, spawn brick wall. Nice. It's kind of high, but that's fine. We, we need as much walls as possible. This has to be stronger than Wall Maria. It has to be stronger than Wall Rose and uh, whatever that other one was. Okay, boom. We spawned ourselves a bunch of walls and let's see if it'll actually block incinerate. Okay, give awakening. Alt is standing in position. I'm standing in position. Okay, perfect. So I'm standing in a good position. As you can see, my alt's right here in the position. 
and can incinerate be stopped by all these walls let's go oh damn oh damn the answer is it cannot <laughs> Now this one we pretty much already know the answer to, but can a bunch of trash cans block incinerate now? <laughs> right, like it looks like I'm literally spawning like like a thousand Arby's sandwiches. Ah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Help! 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 Okay, I've created a giant wall of trash cans is incinerate strong enough to destroy the trash can so my guys this is my wall of trash cans and let's see if it'll kill my dummy so let's loop around let's go charging it up oh my gosh damn damn it looks like like black beads all over the floor. It's like when you spill Oreos everywhere. Damn. Okay, clearly, guys, the incinerate is too powerful. On to the next one. Can God Mode beat Hollow Purple? Now, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I don't even know what fully God Mode does. I know it can defend you from like serious punches and side Thomas stuff, but other than that, I'm not really sure what it does. So let's type it out. Okay, so I have given him God Mode. Okay, perfect. He is presented with the Shield of God Mode. But can you stop? Hollow purple. Waymo. And <laughs> no, indeed, God mode cannot stop hollow purple. Will you be gifted as an e girl? <laughs> oh, damn. I can't believe I wrote this one down. Okay, so we're gonna have to. <laughs> Perfect! What? Perfect! We have created the perfect e-girl. Now, I'm not gonna lie, if somebody reads my name, they might not think it's me, so let's see. Alright, what would an e-girl say to get something? Uh, I'm new. How do you play? <laughs> somebody said cap. <laughs> Hopefully they're talking to somebody else and not. Okay, nobody, nobody's really paying attention to me, bro. Yo, what do you want? <laughs> Yo! What is with y'all? Get out of here. Bro, all I wanted was to be gifted something. Look, look what happened. You bullied E girl, you get hit. Come here. Get out of my game! Alright, guys, so far, I don't think anybody's really gonna gift me anything. Alright, let me try again. Gift me, please. Ooh. Hey, gift me! Don't run from me! Gift me! Gift me! Alright, guys, I don't think it's that easy. Unfortunately, you will not get free gifts as an E girl. Can you grand slam off a tower of trash cans? So let's see, let's set this up. Okay, so what we're gonna do is uh, settings. And I should be lined up here, actually. Ah, okay, boom. So now that we're here, and then we're gonna tell ourselves to fly. Okay, boom. So now that we're flying, we can get up here. We're gonna grand slam off and see if we can hit the Goku. Yeah! Okay, so I landed about there. So let's see if I can push the Goku there. Okay, that good. Okay, thankfully I had my friend here help me get that Goku in position. So let's grand slam and see if it works. Damn! I just hit that boy off the top rope. Okay, so that experiment works. Oh, he said so much damage. I wonder if it gave any more damage than it was supposed to. What happens if you table flip with zero gravity? Give awakening and with the whole G. Then, we're gonna throw this joint to zero. Gravity multiplier, boom, gravity, and table flip. Let's see how high my ult account will go. <laughs> Yo, it's sending it all straight to the sky, bro. Let's see if I can find him. Oh, he should have died before he even fell down. Can a wall stop Sonic shuriken explosion? Okay. Okay, so now that we have it here, Let's see what we got cooking. <laughs> and they work perfectly. <laughs> can a bunch of trash cans stop jet dive? Let's start building our trash can mountain. Okay, so I built myself a nice little hut of trash cans. So let's see if jet dive will just go through it completely. You might have to stand a little bit closer, but... Oh, okay. You're gonna have to try again. 
Try again, but a bit closer. Damn. Okay, so it definitely broke the hut. <laughs> Can a wall stop Genos' blitz shot? Alright, so we have our wall positioned. I'm positioned right there. Let's see if the blitz shot will stop it. He's charging it up. Damn! It went straight through the wall. That explosion is crazy. Can a bunch of dummies stop Flame Wave Cannon? Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna spawn a bunch of blocking dummies. Okay, boom. So we've built ourselves a nice wall of weakest dummies. We've got our alt in position. Okay, so now that we see the angle, let's see if it'll actually cook. Let's go. Three, two, one, boom. Yo, how did I miss? Oh wait, no, but he did it. He hit it perfectly. Yo, it actually stops it! There's no way! Wait, what the heck? Wait, it actually stopped it. Wait. Look, it's not going through! Yo, a bunch of dummies can indeed block Genos' flame wave cannon. That's crazy. I'm gonna try it again for the sake. Goes all the way through and then stops about here. Yeah, because look, all these dummies here are still kind of 100%. 70 plus, yeah, but that was from the other side. Wow, it actually does not go through. So for the next one, can a bunch of dummies stop blue by Gojo? So I'm gonna kind of put my alt in here. Put him like right here, far enough so that I can just still jump into it. And then I'm gonna try and hit him with that blue. So let's go. Whoa! Okay, all of the attacks still went through, but it kind of did defend it. Like I didn't get that far in. Let's try again. Oh, that time. A bunch of dummies may be able to stop Flame Wave Cannon, but still can't stop Gojo. Okay, so the next one is Death Counter versus Speed Blitz Drop. That's Death Counter. Oh, damn. Wait, did it just straight up go through? Bro, it just goes through. Can you fly with Grand Slam? Okay, let's try that. So, no stun, no cooldown. Let's see if you can You can kind of fly with it, but for the most part, it is glitchy. It's definitely not easier than just doing foul ball. Which characters can kill a tree without ult? So let's try a foul ball. <laughs> okay, no. Destructive cyborg. Let's see. Blood shot. Okay, Genos can take out trees with his with his attacks. And I'm pretty sure he's the only one because I know Sonics doesn't. Yep, Genos can take out trees. Explosion sure it can. It is it does attach on, but it does not destroy the tree. Only Genos can break trees in base. So can you foul ball shoot in midair? Now thankfully I already have this wall of trash cans up, so all I have to do really is just fly. Oh, damn, so I guess the, the little end part probably doesn't come out because I have nothing to uh, 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 to. Yeah, you can not foul ball shoot in midair. You can go to heaven if you get zero gravity and jump once, so <laughs> we have tested this before. Bro's on his way to heaven. You right. Hey, you are too, bro. He said, I'm on my way to heaven. Meet you there. <laughs> You're going up. Okay. Oh, wait, I passed your heaven. Oh, wow. So he still has a ceiling, but my ceiling's just completely broken now. What do I even do up here? I think I finally made it, guys. I am in the heaven. Right now, if Poochie used made in heaven, I'd be fine. Okay, so the next one is see if people will get mad at you for third party. Okay, perfect. We are in a public server. So all you have to do is go find some people having a respectable 1v1. Okay, I see these two guys right here. Oh, no, we already got Dial! Oh, right here. Perfect. So I'm gonna come interrupt. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend like I'm gonna steal this guy's kill. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, they both ulted. Oh, no. Is he coming for me? He is indeed coming for me. Ah! Alright, guys, that answer is clear. 
you will get jumped. All right, for the next experiment, you will be given an Oreo if you like this video. All right, y'all let me know if you got it. What happens if you use strength difference on someone who has God mode? This new move truly is crazy, but let's see if God mode is crazier. Bro, wait, did, they, did they change it? Can you, oh yeah, you can turn it. Okay, that was definitely me missing twice, but. All right, three times, three times. Okay, four times, just stand right here. Bro, these are perfect, I swear. No, that's perfect. It, 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 God mode actually is protecting you from it. Can Genos' new move on the Thunder Kick go through walls? Okay, as you can see, my alt is perfectly behind that wall. Let's see if the new Genos move will actually protect you from it. Okay, my alt is there and Thunder Kick. Oh! Damn, it didn't even protect him from the regular thunder kick. <laughs> okay, so now we have him standing back a little bit. Let's see if let's see if it'll still go through. And boom. And it comes down. And it does not. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, Genos is becoming one of the most broken, easily the most broken characters in this game. No need to learn combos, just spam. How far will you get punched at 10 times damage multiplier and 0 0.5 gravity? Oh, okay, this is interesting. So let's let's test this first with obviously the strongest hero. 10 times damage multiplier and to 0 0.5 gravity. So here we are, normal punch. Oh my gosh. Okay, we might have to actually turn down the damage just so we can see how far they truly... Well, I guess it is a one-shot, so... Damn, we, yeah, the, the goal is distance, so let's see. Boom. Oh my gosh. Wait, 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 wait. That looks even farther than I think. Okay, and then we're going to jump on this cliff, and then I'm going to punch him off the cliff and really see how far he can go. <laughs> okay, perfect. I got me positioned right here. Okay, perfect. So now I have my alt set up. We have 0 0.5 gravity and 10 times damage multiplier. Let's see how fast we can knock our boy off. Oh my god, to the other wall? That's insane! Does Genos Blitz Shot have infinite range? Okay. Kind of close with that one. Oh, it hit it. <laughs> wow, it actually sniped that range up. So now let's see if the range is actually infinite. Yeah, it only goes about this far. No infinite range, but still good range. How far does jet dive go? Okay, so we can actually see this now. So go to zero gravity, and we're gonna use jet dive and see if it just goes straight fully down. So we are pretty high now, let's try it out. Oh, let's take the gravity off. 0 0.5 multiplier. And... No, it does not. <laughs> It'll just stop moving. What? At one point... Do there we go. Okay, so yeah, you have to be a certain amount of close to the ground for it to even do the second half of the move. I did not know that before, actually. And this is for the One Piece fans. Can you infinite Gatling? No stun and no cooldown. Actually, since we are in Genos, let's see if it works. So, Opium Goku, we meet again. But now I have a new move. It's called the Robo Gatling! Oh, it's kind of hard to control. Damn, it does damage though. Oh, wait, it's actually because my damage is still high. Okay. Yeah, but there's like a stop in between because he has two moves. Let's try it on the strongest hero. That's not the real Gatling. Let me show you the real Gatling. Consecutive Gobus! Oh man, this just does damage, oh my god. I've destroyed all your pressure points. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my wombo, she did it. This is an interesting one. Can you make a bridge out of walls? Now because the private server actually just added some stuff, we can definitely probably make this bridge a little bit easier than usual. 
But first, actually, let me pick where I'm gonna make this bridge. Am I really gonna build a bridge this far? <sighs> I'm gonna do it for y'all. I have to do it for y'all. Oh my god, this is gonna take so much time. Y'all better like this video, man. I'm really about to build this bridge all the way down to the end. <laughs> Crazy. First, we're gonna fly. Now we're gonna have to go to the spawn wall. Okay. Oh, I can do this pretty fast now. Bro, this bridge is perfect. This bridge is gonna be actually perfect. Bro, we literally got the first beam. Okay, okay, perfect, 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 perfect. Oh my god, my bridge building skills is terrible. You know what, even if it's ugly, this can just be the floor. Okay, so we're kind of got something going here. I ain't gonna lie to you. I, I don't know why I expanded it, but I guess that's what we're doing. So let's do big wall now. Now, today guys, I bring to you the most stable bridge known to man. Absolutely nothing can knock this down. Like look at the craftsmanship, the sheer attention to detail. This isn't dangerous whatsoever. And just to test it, I'm gonna walk from one side to the other. Perfectly fine. I call this the Great Oreo Bridge. <laughs> this is crazy. Alright guys, so still have 0.5 gravity, but we could go ahead and just walk. Hey, see? Oh, stable. You know what I'm saying? Jump to this side, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, 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 ooh. Jump to this side. Yeah! The Great Oreo Bridge. <laughs> I'm gonna need that hashtag in the comments. The Great Oreo Bridge. And perfect. And you can see the shadow of the bridge too. I like that detail, man. Strongest is going crazy. Can Whirlwind Kick go through walls? So as you can see, my alt is right behind this wall. And let's use it, Whirlwind Kick. Oh, that, okay, so does not go through walls. Let's see if it can connect through one though. Oh, it actually can. It actually did connect through it. Yeah, that's crazy. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be another one. This is gonna break the server. Can I fill this server with weakest dummies? <laughs> And we're just gonna spawn dummies, bro. <laughs> Fall! Okay, I don't wanna spoil Attack on Titan, but you know, alright, if you're not caught up to Attack on Titan, just skip this part. Y'all remember that episode when they were like dropping the Titans from the plane? This is kind of like what I'm doing right now. My PC is gonna explode before I actually am able to fill this entire thing. I know what that means. It's pretty much my server <laughs> filled with weakest dummies. Now, obviously, there's some gaps in it, but I'm telling you, my computer was legit. Like, look at this. I can't even, like, the camera's slowing down. Well, let me give you guys a tour of the weakest dummy army. The next time y'all jump Goku to server, ooh, I'm gonna make these all attacking dummies. But look at this, bro. Oh, I thought my computer crashed. I le legit thought my computer crashed. But there is one thing I kind of wanted to try while I'm here. <laughs> I'm about to do the biggest table flip ever. It's time to clean this server up. Bro, it didn't even come out. Bro, it did not even come out. Oh, I'm literally stuck. My character's literally stuck. Bro, even if I re... Okay, let me try to reset. The server is actually unusable. I can't even reset. Okay. Huh. I'm never gonna do that one again. Okay, let's see what's next on the list. Bro, are you kidding me? Can I fill the server with trash cans? Oh my gosh. 
many hours later. Guys, we have finally done it. Oh my gosh. Guys, we have finally done it. And I'm not even going to lie to you. Just take a look. Just take a look. Ooh, here we are. I filled the floor with trash cans. Why did I do this? How long did this take me? Bro, I literally spent like 40 minutes in here just placing trash cans. Yes, I placed every one of these trash cans. And for why? Why? I'm not even like busting anything. I'm just going insane. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Does red reversal have infinite rage? Oh, I don't know. Oh, my gosh. It actually killed him. Damn. Okay, so not infinite rage, but damn near the whole map range. Can Saitama use a nine page Muda from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? You fool. You are useless. Muda, 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 Okay, you definitely can. How far can you shove someone with zero gravity? Okay, well, it has no farther distance with zero gravity. How far can you uppercut someone with zero gravity? Okay, so. That's 0 0.5 gravity, but with actual zero gravity? <laughs> I can literally send him to heaven with that one. Can you make a basketball net out of brick? All right, so we got to start off with the foundation of the net. What is blood cooking? Ender portal? What the heck? Oh, hold on now. Oh, I'm making a hoop. It's going to be the best hoop net ever. All right. Ooh, cash. Cash money records. All right, cash. Oh. Corner shooter. Cash. Oh, off the rim? Imagine as a mini game you had, uh, you know, like the NBA shoot off. You get five shots <laughs> in each corner. Oh. Hey, cash. Oh my goodness. Hold on now. Lay up oh, off the backboard. But yeah, guys, feel free to recreate this ball that and have fun with your friends and private service. Can you wall combo on trees? So I got my dummy set up right against the tree to wall combo. Let's see if we can. Oh, I mean, you kind of can. You just have to make sure you hit the right moves on them. Yeah. Can you wall combo on benches? Now this one I'm definitely not sure is true. <laughs> yeah, they're just gonna fly over the bench. And if I down slam it just goes straight through it. Throw him into it. Oh, he just goes through. So no you cannot wall combo off benches. But can you wall combo on trash cans and throw him into the trash can? Oh, nope, never mind. The trash can will just move. I feel like it has happened to me before, though, in game. Like, I, I I, do feel like there is a sweet spot where you can actually wall combo somebody off a trash can. It's probably just brief. Can you lethal whirlwind stream in zero gravity? And... So, my alt is kind of lower than me, but if I... <laughs> Yo! Oh, my gosh! It threw him all the way down. Now he's coming back up. Can you flow in water in zero gravity? Oh, you can! Oh, damn! He is flown away. Can you use a finisher in zero gravity? Okay, so he should be finisher level. Okay, so now if we both jump at the same time. And I catch his ass. Oh, you can use a finisher in zero gravity! <laughs> Will Water Stream Rock Smash knock you to the ground in zero gravity? Oh, well, no, we'll try this one first. Okay, it actually worked. Yeah, let's try. How far will you fly if you do the final hunt in zero gravity? Gravity is at zero. Alright, let us go. Damn, okay, it is knocking him up. No, come here. How far does death counter go while in zero gravity? All the zero gravity tests now. I mean, it is an experiment, of course. Now let's see how far it's gonna knock him. Woo! 
Oh my god, his head is still floating. Okay, guys, that test was actually crazy, but I think we need to do that test really on the on the cliff to really see how far it's gonna go. And click. Oh, this is bad. Oh! Oh my god! Yo, its body part flew past the map! No, that is crazy! <laughs> That's insane! 57. How far does a serious punch reach in zero gravity? So, and let's see how far this serious punch is gonna go. I should put my camera back. Oh my gosh! Yo! He's gone! That boy is going straight to the moon, bruh. That one was actually crazy. How far will strength difference send you flying in zero gravity? So we're gonna test this one twice. First we're gonna test it on the floor, and then we're gonna test it off the top of the cliffs. Here we are. Strength difference. How far are you gonna go? Yo! <laughs> we got another one to the moon. Strength. Difference. Let's see how far. Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh, we gotta do that again. No way, bro. Did I just score in the basketball net? There's no way. I have to check the replay. I have to check the replay. Did I just score in the basketball net? No, stop playing. Alright, so here is the table flip in zero gravity. We knocked him back. Let's see how far he's gonna go. <laughs> like a rocket. Oh, I can barely even notice him out of that. Oh, he died in between the reset. So, it's sending you straight to the moon. Oh, 60. This one's a little bit easier, but can you spawn walls in midair? Obviously, we tested that before, and yes. Can you spawn? There you go. You can indeed spawn walls in midair. How long does it take? to reach one end of the map with a 10 times speed multiplier. All right, and then let's put our speed multiplier to 10. Right now we have ourselves a 10 times speed multiplier. Oh my gosh, that was quick. Now we're gonna see how long it takes for me to get to one side of the map to the other. And three, two, one, go. Wee! Okay, this is the real s speed of sound, Sonic speed. <laughs> Can Garo counter Sonic's ninja star? Two, one, shoot me! Hey ya! Damn! Right, Alright, now for the next one. How long does it take with a zero times speed multiplier? I better not be here all day, man. Three, two, one, let's go. And boom, that is the time right here, folks. How long does it take to die in the storm? Ooh, that's, that's, that's a cool one. Okay, so. Oh, okay, there you guys go. That is how long it takes to die in the storm. 64, can you escape a box trap of walls? Okay. As you can see guys, we are fully immersed in a box trap. This design actually looks pretty cool. Okay, so we are fully immersed in a box trap. Let's see if we can make our way out of this trap. <laughs> okay, uh, not gonna lie, Saitama was probably the wrong person to try this with. 
Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch. Let's switch to something that might be able to get out of this. Okay, let's try Genos. This is the structure we're trapped in. Now let's see if we can escape. This was the dumbest experiment I thought of. What if, what was I thinking? What 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 was I thinking that's gonna happen? Huh? What did I honestly think was gonna happen? Stupid wall. Come here. Are you kidding me? How far can an attacking dummy punch you in zero gravity? <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. Oh boy, at zero gravity. Now let's see how far this dude can punch me. Come on. Give me your best. Oh, there's not even knockback. Nah. I, w I wish it was like a comboing dummy. Well, the answer to that is absolutely nowhere. <laughs> Can blitz shot knock away a bunch of trash cans? Now this should be true. We're gonna make a thick wall of trash cans. Of delicious trash cans. Y'all, I'm doing a hundred experiments, y'all. Please forgive me going insane. Blitz shot. Let's see. Well, that was the easy experiment I've done. <laughs> On to the next one. Can ignition burst? knock away a wall of trash cans. Well, I'm gonna just still use the same one because obviously we know the answer, so boom. Yep, yes indeed, it can. Will trash cans all respawn in the position you originally had them in? Perfect, so we knocked all these trash cans down. All we have to do is see when they respawn if they'll go to the exact position that we placed them in. Okay, and boom, they actually have respawned. Let's go, let's go. Like before, you saw us make a basketball net out of brick. Now, let's see if we can make a basketball net out of trash cans. Here, let's install this ball net right here, so boom. Oh, this is definitely gonna look better than the, than the other one. Okay, let's make that it, right, right, right. Boom! There we go! I have made the perfect basketball <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. Hey, what do y'all think of my basketball net? Comment, just be honest, just be fully honest. Tell me how great my basketball net is. Just tell me how great my basketball net is. Like, Look at guys, we got ourselves the full basketball net. I call this the Oreo Net 2020, you know what I'm saying? In stores now. Why did I say 2020? I meant the Oreo Net 2023, you know what I'm saying? We got a new bottle coming 2024. But yeah, this is the Oreo basketball net. And now it's time for us to take some shots. Okay, let's see if it actually works. Let's see if we can cook. Let's see if we can cook. Hey! Oh, I made it too high again. Okay, so I'm about to jump in. Hey! Yes, sir! All of that! Let's go! Stop playing with a young king. Now, number 70. Can you build a sky base? Okay, okay, okay. So now we can cook. Now we can really cook. Stop cooking, man. Right? Stop cooking, man. Right? The best thing about a sky base is that uh, it's in the sky. So first of all, we're going we're gonna to try and just really make a nice sky base. It's going to be a little bit better than our basketball net. So first, I'm going to set the foundation, right? I'm going to set the foundation. Boom! Just like, just like that, just like that, boom, just like that, you know what I'm saying, boom, oh, perfect, okay, okay, just like that, boom, yo, stop playing, stop playing, stop playing, stop playing, okay, okay, alright, boom, just like that, y'all, the foundation is built on the sky base, okay, now we just gotta get some walls up, maybe get a little levels, you know what I'm saying, maybe we can make it nice, we can make it nice, boom, okay, first wall up, Oh, nice and flat. That's what I like to see. A little gap in there, but that's cute. That's cute. Okay, now we cook it. 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 Oh, 
Oh, yes, sir. Ski stop playing with a young builder, man. Call me Oreo the Builder. Hold on. Okay, perfect, y'all. We are cooking. Oh my gosh, the sky base is looking tough. Oh, this is the Legion of Doom. Hold on. Now, for the roof, I'm kind of feeling a creative flow here. Just let me cook. Eat the sky base. You can see the TV busting out the wall. Don't worry about that. We're going to fix that later. But yeah, bro. Yes, you can, in fact, build a sky base with your squad. <laughs> Look at your boy, you know what I'm saying? It's me right there, young Oreo. You know what I'm saying? About to enter the crib. You got the chair right there, trash can. Big TV. Stop playing with your boy. You know what I'm saying? That's about a. I don't know how many inches that would be, but we gonna move on. <laughs> oh my god. The next one is Can you build a tree house? Now, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I put in work on this house, so. Wait, I'm just gonna be here. Oh, never mind. So now we just gotta build a simple house. Just build a simple little tree house. We already put it in. Yo, like the sky base is tough, but bro, the tree house is actually super tough. 24 hours later. All right, y'all, after time and time again, the tree house is complete. Now, as you can see, built up on a tree house right underneath right there. Let's give y'all a nice little tour, man. Let's give y'all a tour of the tree house, man. So as you can see, the sky base up there, bridge to the sky base right there. And then we got the bridge to the tree house. You can see me right there chilling. And let's go see what we have in the crib eyes. Okay, so we got, it's kind of hard to miss. As soon as you walk in, 80 inch flat screen TV, smart appliances, everything applied, everything hooked up. This is probably, you're probably looking at it and like, oh, this is just steel. This is the most comfortable couch you've ever seen in your life. If you were to sit on this, you would actually be memorized, mesmerized. And here is the trash can, you know, throw your garbage away. Yeah, we talking like the best crib ever. The Oreo cabin of like this goddamn video. This took me forever to make. <laughs> Can you make a giant basketball net out of walls? But there's going to be a twist. This time, I'm not going to be shooting a, a basketball into a net. This time, I'm going to be shooting a person. Okay, boom. Okay. Very simple design, you know what I'm saying? But this is the giant basketball net. And guess what? We're going to knock our alt all the way from this cliff into that basketball net. Now, I'm not going to lie, guys. We see the basketball net over there. Hopefully, I get this in one try because that'll be perfect. It doesn't mess up. Let's see. Oh, it's good. It's good. Yeah, we made it. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Alright, and for our next one, can two attack dummies kill each other? Let's see if they'll actually kill each other. So, spawn attack a dummy. Hey! Hey! Don't hit me! Get down there. Here we go. Okay. So, there's one attacking dummy in position. Spawn attacking dummy. And there's two! Okay! They're duking it out! They're. Oh! Oh, damn, he's socking him. Oh, yo, fight back. Bro, fight. Bro, fight back. Damn. 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 I didn't expect it to go like this. Bro, he's just, he's just knocking him. He's just, <laughs> yo, we all got your money up, bro. Now, the thing is, he's hitting him, but I don't think their health is going down. Yeah, their health is not going down. I'm seeing, like, percent hits, but they are not going down. The next one is... Can normal punch destroy a fragile wall? We have it here. Let's use our normal punch and let's see if it breaks it. It does not. Oh, but consecutive punches does break it? That's funny. Maybe it's just only shield break moves then. Can you jet dive from cliff to cliff? To cliff? Well, the thing is, what I'm going to have to do, right, is I'm going to have to fly. And then once I get close enough to the ground, it will naturally... Allow me to jet dive towards it. But straight jet dive cliff to cliff? No, you cannot. Because it stops you from going down. And I'm going to cheat. Cliff to cliff? You know what? I might as well dunk. 
There we go. Straight cliff to cliff. And here I am dunking myself. Woo! Did I just land on the rim? What happens if you foul a ball on a bunch of trash cans? Okay, let's see. Yes, sir. I know this is just a notice, but let's see what happens if we foul ball a bunch of trash cans. So first, we'll do like the far away one. Damn! Android exploded expendishly. Will dummies take fall damage? Let's see. Alright, we're gonna knock it up. Alright, and then as soon as they fall, let's see if they have fall damage. Nope. Dummies cannot have fall damage. There you go. Oh, okay, so will the fall damage on Metal Bats all to get higher in higher places? Okay. Turn it on. Ooh. Ooh. I don't really see how much fall damage that gives. Oh, well, I guess it didn't really give fall damage because the gravity's still low. So let's. Ooh. So that one gave it. It's not giving it more fall damage because you just it just loaded up. Or can you smash benches with home run? Let's try the second part. And yes, you can. There we go. Does Sonic move the fastest with ten times speed in alt? Okay. Three, two, one, go. I think you definitely do move faster in alt though. <laughs> Now let's see if Sonic is just naturally going to be faster. Now let's see if he, Sonic's faster. Okay, boom. Now that actually seemed regular, but I'm sure if I use this move... It's completely different, yep. Now, does Sonic run faster in alt with zero speed? Three, two, one, go. Boy, this is going to take forever. <laughs> oh. Sonic, I thought you were the fastest. Why are you running so slow? Oh my gosh, we're almost there, we're almost there, boom, and go. Oh, all right, let's see who's faster. Are trash cans affected by low gravity? Let's shot. Oh, trash cans are indeed infected by zero gravity. That is crazy. Oh. Oh, that trash can's gone. Yep, there's the trash can. It does indeed get infected by zero gravity. Can Flame Wave Cannon beat 10 walls? Okay, let's set this up. I'm hyped. We have ourselves set up. We've got exactly 10 walls. So let's see if it can cook. Damn! It can't even beat one wall! <laughs> so now, can Speed Blitz Drop Kick beat a wall? Nope, can't even beat the wall. Wow, that's tough. Can Thunder Kick beat a wall? We have the W right here, so let's see if Thunder Kick will connect if we do it super close. Oh, it actually does! Yep, so the Thunder Kick does actually indeed beat a wall. But can Incinerate beat 10 walls? We're gonna get my ult to stand right behind the 10 walls, and then we're gonna see 
if Incinerate is still strong enough to just go through it. Final Flash! Oh, yes it is. Not even 10 walls could beat the Incinerate. Oh, sorry. Does Incinerate have infinite range? Now, I'm pretty sure this one actually just doesn't. So my dummy's over there. I'm going to stand all the way far back. And let's see if it still touches. And no, it does not. It does not have infinite range. But does Flame Wave Cannon have infinite range? Okay. So, three, two, one, launching. Woo! Here comes the blast. Damn. Now the range is not infinite, but it is definitely map wide. How far does Speed Blitz Dropkick go? So now that we've measured that, and we've seen that the Flame Wave Cannon goes there, let's see how far the Speed Blitz goes. Can I do this while jumping? Well, yeah, about half that. Does fourfold strike go through walls? So let's hit it with the fourfold strike. Now, although it went through, it looks like it did no damage. That's actually crazy. Okay, that time it went through and no damage. So yeah, fourfold strike will go through a wall, but it will cause. However, does straight on go through a wall? Okay, let's see. Ooh, so now there's a good amount of distance. Now let's see if there's fourfold. We'll just. The straight on will just go through it. Bro's head is attached to the wall, bro. <laughs> the answer is no. Straight on will not go through the wall. What happens if you carnage a bunch of weakest dummies? Now this is gonna this is this is where we get to the part where this server is gonna crash. And I and I kinda don't want my server to crash because I built that beautiful treehouse, the beautiful sky base, and all these trash cans and the basketball net. We made some memories here today, boys. I'm not gonna lie to you. Fun dummies. And I'm gonna throw some blocky ones in there too. Just just to mix it up. You know what? I'm gonna throw some No, I'm not gonna throw any attacky ones in there. That'll mess this whole thing up. Now let's hit it with the carnage and see the chaos. We are Damn! My popcorn. Hold on, I even hit all of them. Now for fun, let's go ahead and try the fourfold strike on all these W's. We need to cut all their heads off. So let's see if it works. Woo! It definitely does! <laughs> That's crazy. Alright, so what if you carnage a bunch of trash cans? So thankfully we still have our trash can set up here. Ooh. But we kinda messed it up, so we already kinda proved that one. They will all go flying. Now what happens if you serious punch a bunch of weakest dummies? Okay, so the weakest dummies are here. I'm gonna spawn some more because some of these guys are weak from the last one. So as you can see, I'm right here, ready, posted. Let's see it. Serious punch. Wait, what? Bro, it even sent them flying. It just like killed most of them. What? It didn't even kill them. They just all straight up fell on the ground. Yo, a bunch of them got knocked over here, I didn't even know. What happens if you serious punch a bunch of walls? Now, we have already tested this one. Now, here we have a bunch of walls. This is the house that we built earlier. And let's see if we can do any damage. Serious punch! Damn! The power of the walls still couldn't face it. And that brings us to the next one. What happens if you table flip a bunch of dummies? Alright, so we have all our dummies lined up here. They're all low health, so I'm expecting these boys to just fly away. Like, they should just fly and die. No shenanigans like with the serious punch, but they should just float and die. Bro! Yo, these dummies are sturdy, man! When you spawn- Oh, my computer- Oh, dad, the game is lagging. The server is slowly breaking, boys. Oh my gosh. What happens if you Garo alt surrounded by dummies? Okay, that's interesting. Give awakening. Now, the funny thing is, if I jump in here, I have a strong feeling I'm gonna get stuck. <laughs> so, let's see what happens. 
I am surrounded by the dummies. Let's ult. Dio! Oh, it sent them up slowly, though. <laughs> it sent them up slowly, but surely it was there. How far can you knock someone with final hunt at the top of a cliff? Oh, this is gonna be fire. This is gonna be fire. Let's see the damage we can do. Boom. Bang! Huh. I'm not gonna lie. I was, I was expecting a little bit more. <laughs> but thank you guys for making it this far. And just because you made it this far, I'm gonna give you a bonus one. If you made it this far into the video, you will like and subscribe. Boy, you better well like and subscribe. Do you know how long it took me to get all this stuff done? And that, yeah. Let me calm down. Let me eat an Oreo. Let me calm down.